Okay, we get to go talk to Spike. Hold up a second. Seriously, I'm still at zero percent of the story. That's crazy. It's crazy talk. But it's all like light outside now. Yay for light. Okay. Let's go find Spike. Silly zombies. Tricks are for kids. Do you have a limit on how much you can run? I think I found that out myself. You just run too much. You can run out of stamina. Maybe. The lighting is really weird. My character does not want to keep running. Okay. Ah. Oh, wow. Oh, shit. Damn it. Get out. All right, Spike, where are you? Woo! Hey, keep a distance from Rises, man. They just as soon shoot you as look at you. I don't like that gamma increase. Looks weird. Alright, well, what's dead zone? <coughs> Changes input threshold of the controller sticks? I don't understand that one, but okay, we'll throw that just right where it is. Keep a lookout for the color. Alright, Spike, Spike, I'm here. What's up? What's up? Crane. <laughs> Jake. First of all, you did great out there. From now on, if you need something, come see me. And to start with, use a UV flashlight and a remote control. Thank you. You run up on a volatile, give him a face full of UV, or lead him into a trap which you can trigger with that remote. You got it? Got it. Perfect. Now for the bad news. Despite your efforts, Brecken's mission failed. Oh, shit, is he okay? He's alive. But you need to get back to the tower. Jay called all the scouts in, and that means you. Okay. Wonder if I'll finally get to meet Brecken in person. Probably not. Okay. I keep getting a message saying that I've got skill points that I can... that I need to spend, so let's look at that. Select one of the skill trees to spend your points. So, survivor, agility, power. Well, I can't do anything with power, so... Let's look at Survivor. Gives you access to supporting abilities, blueprints, and gadgets. Increase Survivor rank, complete quests, help other survivors, and participate in challenges. The higher your rank, the better equipment offered by shops. Okay. What's this? Learn how to craft the most basic things needed for survival. Lock picks, firecrackers, simple throwing stars, and Molotov cocktails. Sweet! Yes, I do want to learn that one. Oh, you gotta be survival level 4 for that stuff. Not all of it. I'm level 3, so I can do a little bit more. Learn how to use plants to create boosters, which allow you to fight without getting tired, run fast, see better in darkness, or develop more resistance to attacks. <coughs> Learn how to use space in your backpack more efficiently, gain 4 new slots for carrying weapons. I like that. But I also like this too. We're going to go with this one instead. Okay. And then let's do it. Let's look at agility. Well, we got one option: dodging coming attacks by jumping sideways or backways. Move in the desired direction and press right bumper to execute. Sure, works for me. Blueprints. I can make lock picks with metal parts. Really? Firecrackers, I need household supplies. I need toxic lichen. Fluorescent shrooms. Fluorescent shrooms. <laughs> Do I consume them? <laughs> no wonder I can see better at night with that. Underwater algae. Alcohol and herbs. Flares, Molotovs, throwing stars. Various stuff.
for when you want to take someone down but send the message you're not worth a bullet or when you're out of bullets. Electrify a water pipe and what do you get? A clever way to play on words. And a good tool for caving in skulls. Alright. A little short on stuff for that. Okay, inventory. We just got the gas pipe and the floor plank. We're gonna stick with we're gonna keep with the Wait, how do I switch weapons? Oh, that's how I use the flashlight. Okay. Was that always an option? Because that did not look like a very powerful flashlight. What are these? I got... What? What are all these weapons? Get this shit out of here. I want it. I also don't want the pipe. We're going to stick with the rusty adjustable wrench and the water pipe. <coughs> yeah, we'll roll with what we got there. Can't really do anything with any of that stuff. Quests. We got to get back to the tower. Okay. Oh, okay. You know, let's try it out. Why not? Let's try it out on this guy right here. It doesn't seem to be doing much. Fuck it. I'm out. I can't jump that high. Man, was this flashlight always an option and I just didn't see it earlier? Probably was, and I feel like an idiot. But I'm right here. What am I supposed to do? Oh. Seriously, I have to go all the way up here just so I can report, and then I have to go back? Seriously? That's obnoxious. Hey. Crane here. Report. I'm about to have a meeting with the tower's leader. Acknowledged. Confirm his identity and contact us immediately. Okay, well that... That was a little obnoxious, because I was here, but I was told not to be here. <laughs> whatever. Whatever. Hi. Hi. You Easy. have new items for me. Yes, you do. Okay. Well, that's all for that stuff, I guess. You can craft a new item! Awesome! Don't really give a damn. Where am I going? To the elevator. My bad. Just trying to figure stuff out, right? Just trying to figure stuff out. Takes time. Takes time with new Reckon's games. Brecken's mission failed. Jade called a meeting in the tower. It's my opportunity to finally meet with Brecken and confirm his identity. Are we sure this is even the right guy? Like, are we sure? Sorry, guys. I had to look at something. All right, never mind. Whatever. Where am I going? Oh my God! There's exclamation points. Hi, Timor. Good job out there, thirty-one. Uh, I mean, Crane, right? <coughs> That's it. That's it. You had an exclamation point. Hi. What do, what do you have? French wrench. Okay. Oh, are you limited on repairs? I just saw that.
As you see, already up when I heard a little bit. I have nothing. I don't have any mods. Okay, never mind. I'm just looking through stuff, guys, just trying to figure out exactly what I have as options around here. What do we have in here? Oh, okay. It's my room. Let's throw on the athlete outfit. Why not? Okay. Let's go. Hi. Dude, I want some coffee. Where'd you get that? Dude, coffee. Ah! Give me coffee. Fine. Don't give me coffee. Be a douche. Who broke the mirror? It's not very nice, guys. It's vandalism. We, we do not survive with vandalism. Crane. Hello. Listen. Reckon and a team of runners went after an airdrop last night. Yeah, I'm aware he of this. lost the rest of his team to Biters, and then Rise's men ambushed him, beat him to a pulp, and stole the drop. Now Brecken wants to go after the next drop himself, but we can't let him, and you've got to back me up, okay? For God's sake! You can't even walk straight! We need you alive, you idiot! Okay, we're going in. Act confident. Okay, Jade. Reckon? Confidence. Awesome. Lena? Maybe you can get through to him. Jade, who's your friend? Kyle Crane. Look, Brecken, the last thing we need is for you to go back out there. We can figure out another way without jeopardizing you. Right, Crane? I'll go. I'll do it. Right. Yes. Crane will go. He'll be happy to. Jesus. No offense, friend, but you're as green as grass. You can't just... Crane will manage. He'll start in the right spot. And Lena's right. You need to be here taking care of the towers, convincing them the world's not over yet. Oh, hell. Maybe one more try before we go to Rice. Yeah. Okay, fine. Good luck, Crane. Thank you, Brecken. Jade, a moment. Sure. Head for the cauldron. I'll be in touch shortly. Okay, awesome. I think I can manage that, right? Where's the cauldron? Look, Hi, Lena. There's something else we need to discuss. Brecken was hurt pretty bad out there. Worse than he wants people to know. He took a blow to the head. Now he's starting to have seizures, and I don't have any Lora tracks. Yeah, I doubt anyone does. Anti-seizure drugs were being passed out like candy when the infection first started. And the stores ran out weeks ago. Yes, that's right. How do you know that? Look, what do you need me to do, Lena? There's a man in town named Ghazi. He's not altogether there, if you know what I mean. His mother had epilepsy, so he used to pick up medicine for her each month. She died. Two years ago, but Ghazi kept going to the store to pick up her prescription. He likes his routine, and Ghazi can be very... insistent. So, they kept giving it to him. You think he's been stockpiling it all this time? If he hasn't, I don't know where else we're going to get it from. Ghazi lives under the <clears throat> overpass. And don't mention his mother's death. He won't understand. So, will I get to kill him then? Is that how this is gonna go down? What are the little exclamation points for? They're everywhere. Upstairs, upstairs. This one's not upstairs. This one's right here. Hi, Jared. Hey, do you have spare keys for 202? Well, what's the problem? I don't think so. Something's going on in there. The door's locked <laughs> from inside. I don't think I have spare keys to room 202. Let's go upstairs, see what's else up here. There it is again. Bayer, is that you? What's going on, guys? What's going on here? Bayer's locked himself in the room. We could hear him screaming. He may have turned. You hear that? 
I can't get this lock. You want to try it? So can I try and like lockpick it? Oh, nope, I'm going the wrong way. Oh, come on, really? Wait, where am I supposed to go with this? Are you right there? Nope. Oh, crap. I'm so close, too. You gotta pick that lock. There we go. Oh, he's good. Hello. Here. You in here? Help me. What? Where are you, dude? Dude, where are you at? Like, legitimately. This is not a very big place. Oh, hi. Tell me what's wrong. I can't move. My chest feels like it's going to explode. Are you turning? No, no. I took antizin and the pain started. Ugh. The vial is on the floor. What did you actually take, dude? What you took is junk. What? It's fake. Where did you get this from, Bahir? Please, I need a doctor. First, tell me who sold you that. I can't, I promised. This guy is very useful. He brings me things from the outside. Yeah, like phony antizin? People could be giving this to their kids. You want them to go through this? No! God, no! Then tell me who sold it to you. Yusuf. He's one of the scouts. He lives on the roof. Okay, I'll get Dr. Lena. God oh, damn it, Yusuf. Please, hurry. God damn it, Yusuf. What All happened? Right. Did you kill him? What? I didn't kill no. shit. Look, he's not turning, but he needs a doctor. I thought he was turning. We should still keep an eye on him. Nobody's fucking turning. Doctor, I've got to get out of here. Doctor. I need to get my wife and kids somewhere safe. You know, it seems to me this is about the only safe place there is. <sighs> Safest place in the slums, maybe. But the slums aren't safe. It's no place for my family. And I found a way out. You mean out of the slums? I can't tell you the details. But I need to get across town, and I can't do it without a gun. If you'll get me one, I'll tell you about a place that hasn't been looted yet. I promise you won't regret it. Well, how do you know this place hasn't been looted? Because there's only one person that has access to this place. And you're looking at him. Bring me a gun, and the key is yours. As well as everything you find there. Okay... <sighs> find a lot of gun. Where would I even go about doing stuff like that. That's it? I can't move the map around? Really? Really? That's it? Okay, well, what else do I have? Quests. Let's go talk to this person. Take the fake and into Lena. Okay. We can handle that. Let's go talk to... Let's go find Lena. Let's do it. This is going to be a long walkthrough if I do all these sorts of, like, extra stuff, too. Totally not Lena, dude, but you are creepy as shit when you snore. You are a very creepy snore. Why? Oh. I thought there were, like, another dude just, like, laying on the floor. It's like, what the hell? These people can't find reasonable places to lay down? Still the wrong floor. Gotcha. And we're going down again. Okay, we're here. Lena. Hi. You better have a look at this. <laughs> the lot number's wrong. Is this a fake? Someone on 21 took it, and now he can't even get off the floor. Aman, get down to 21 now. Where did he get it from? Get down. Yusuf. He's one of the scouts. Well, he can't be producing it here. Someone's supplying him. I'll have a talk with Yusuf. The sooner the better. Don't hurt him. Just talk to him. Okay, now let's go talk to Yusuf. Might as well finish this side quest while we're at it, you know. Do some stuff since we're here. 
in a safe zone without zombies everywhere all over us. Alright, Yusuf, where are you? Climb up there, come on. What? I went through that effort of jumping up here just for it to tell me that he was further down. Ow. Oh, is this Yusuf? You're totally not Yusuf. Are you Yusuf? You are! Yusuf? Welcome to Yusuf's Emporium. If it's hard to find, you need to find Yusuf. Whatever your needs, Yusuf has it all. Yeah, I'm looking for Antizen. Well, of course you are. My friend, this is your most lucky day. No, Yusuf, it's your lucky day. Because I'm going to give you a chance to come clean and tell me where you got that counterfeit junk you sold to Bahir. Bahir? Bahir, you say? Do I know this, Bahir? He nearly died from that phony Antizen you sold him. Phony? Are you sure? You're saying it's no good. I just bought ten vials from those guys. I paid good money. Which guys? Well, that's kind of a sensitive issue. Oh, Which guys, Yusuf? I'm running out of patience. There's a building next to the drugstore. A couple of survivors live there. I don't know how many. I've never been inside. They have medicines. Some of them are real. I guess from the drugstore. They also cook their own stuff. The guy I deal with is named Bento. All right, now you're going to burn the rest of those vials. But they cost me a lot of money. It'll cost you a lot more if I find you peddling that junk anymore. 